Hello everyone, welcome to Cornflower Crafts. I'm here today to join in, in on an open collab that's Let's Do Die Cutting Monday. Our hostesses are Tree, Craft On, and Kathy's Creative Crafts and More. And I will put their links in the description box below. This is an open collab. It is a very popular collab. And... Um, today I went back, I've been doing my fake bakes, but I went back to paper crafting because I needed to create two thank you notes, um, for two very special ladies who were very kind to me recently and I wanted to thank them. Um, and the first card that I made, there is a die cut here and a die cut here, the thank you, the sentiment. This die comes from Hobby Lobby. I got it on clearance. I think it was either three or four sentiments. And I, I really like using it because I think that font is gorgeous. And as you can see, paper-wise, I used um, from the same paper pad. Let me show you real quick. Um, let's see what. It's this one, Pretty Posy. It says, by first edition paper. And I got that at Joanne Fabrics um, some time ago when I had a 60% off coupon. <laughs> and I used several papers out of that. And not only do each one of these have the die cuts on the front, now this one has the same, but in the gold metallic paper. Um, and the, But this one has the little birdie looking up at the sentiment. And so we have the bow, the birdie, and the sentiment. Then you open them up. I haven't written in them yet because I wanted to take part in this open collab. But each of them has just a little pocket normally I dress up my pockets with lace here and and do all sorts of goodies here, but I thought, you know, I'm trying to keep it as flat as possible. Um, I will have to put extra postage on there, but hopefully, hopefully they won't run this through the machine. I hope, I hope with that extra postage they shouldn't, but that's not always the case. So then in these little bags, there are... And this one, there are some flower die cuts. And the one that this is going to, now these papers match the card, but the ones this is going to, she absolutely loves purple. So I thought she might enjoy receiving um, these die cuts. These are the, this, um, I forget where I take a lot of my tag dies and I just put them together. So I'm sorry, I don't know who creates this one or this one. But I thought, when I thought of her, I thought, well, rather than have everything match the paper that I use, maybe have something that is her color that she, you know, can use in, in her creations. So I have, and I try to place the die cuts so that they won't be all bunched at the bottom. But of course, by the time it reaches her, I hope they're going to still be in the bag. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> There's hoping. And then I'm, I write the message here. And then my other one, um, same thing. What I tried to do is put the pocket to match this piece in the center. Well, not the center. It's off center, actually, so that the birdie can look at it. And in this one, my friend who receives this one loves, loves, loves birds. And I'm not sure if I have ever sent her these die cuts before because when I think of her, I think of birds and the color teal. And... <laughs> And she just loves the color too. And so that's what I did here. I did give her one that matched the paper and then one that I thought looked good with them. 
I wanted the little gold to, to show with the thank you die cut on the front of her card. Um, she does a lot of junk journals and I think um, if I know her these will be used and these her color I think might be used in maybe junk journaling as well or cards or any other paper project she has or even on gifts she's very creative both of them are very talented very creative ladies and I want to thank you all for joining me today. And I hope you guys have a wonderful morning, afternoon, or evening. Bye-bye, everybody. Take good care.